Welcome to another section of the video. So this section of the video is meant to take you through uh, for placement, how you can um, view students that are placed to your school. And this falls to those of us that are in the sec um, junior secondary school category. So how do you view students that are placed to your school and how are you going to um, place them into your appropriate um, classes? This is majorly for GSS1 um, classes, placement into GS1. So for those schools that are um, junior secondary school for GSS1, how do you view students that are placed to your school and how are you going to place them to the appropriate um, classes, okay? And this is majorly for the um, SPAs. Okay, so we are just going to quickly do a brief demonstration around that. Okay, so first you need to do as SP is to log into your school. Once you log in under enrollment, you see the um, learner's placement. Okay, and you see the my school placement. So this page here gives you all information around all the students that are placed to your school. We are going to see all the details um, um, displayed here. Okay. You see the analytics is just giving you a description around what is the time, what is total female and where are they coming from. Okay, so um, you will be seeing all the list of the student um, displaying here. This place is displaying the previous school that the child is coming from. Alright, so this is the child um, detail. So what you will be doing as the SP is placing them to class. You can print out this list. I'm sure some of us have already done that. Print out this list and paste it to your school. So um, student coming in can check. Alright, so once you have received the student, they've come in, you double check from your placement list here that it is the student that is coming in. Once you have double checked that and you'll be placing them appropriately to their class. Alright, so this action button here, if you click on it, you see add to class. Right, so if you click on add to class, so it displays the student um, details here. So you can double check with the student then, then you can now select the class that you want to place that student. So let's just do a practical example uh, now right so once it's once it's displayed you can just select the class that you want to display the student to so if this is going to display all the available gss one class that you have all the available just one class arms that you have in your school so you can now select the one to place the student um appropriately once you have done that you notice that here you it will, it will display for those that you have placed it will display the various class arm that you have placed them into so that is how you'll be placing you'll be able to view students that are placed to your school for placement to gss1 and you'll also be able to admit them into their various class arm and the person that are doing this majorly is the spa so as the spa once you have received them double check from your school placement list to see the student right then you'll be able to place them into the appropriate class arm you can also print this um, student list you can print it as well and paste it so that students can double check before coming for you to um, place them so that is majorly how you'll be able to view and place students that are placed into your school into the available um, classroom so hope this video was helpful so check out more on the youtube channel for videos and for demo videos on how you'll be able to um, utilize all of these um, features thank you